If everything in the known universe is composed of atoms, then we should all have a basic understanding of the atom and the three fundamental subatomic particles, the proton, the neutron, and the electron. It is important to be able to quickly deduce the quantity of each of these subatomic particles so that you can gain a better understanding of the atom you are examining. In fact, different atoms have distinct chemical properties and reactivities due to the different numbers of protons, neutrons, and electrons. In the early 1900s, many brilliant minds were changing the landscape of science. In particular, Quantum theory was emerging and changing the way we viewed the atom. Second, for a day, a week, and a manner with fixed energy around the nucleus, and then imagine that we take a picture of this electron every second for a day, a week, or month, we see that all these pictures laid on top of one another begin to form an electron cloud around the nucleus. Remember, all these hypothetical pictures, or data points, represent where the electron has been over time. If we now attempt to create a three-dimensional surface to encompass 90% of all these data points, we obtain a sphere, which is often called the boundary surface. Although this diagram may look complicated, Remember that each line abstractly represents an orbital and that all of these orbitals overlap on the same atom. Here you can see that a 1s orbital is the first orbital that the electrons will reside in. Then the 2s orbital is on top of that. Then the three 2p orbitals are on top of them. And so on, and so on, until the necessary amount of orbitals are present to house all the electrons that an atom may possess. If chemistry is considered to be the central science, then having a basic understanding of the atom and the three fundamental subatomic particles, the proton, the neutron, and the electron is essential. After all, the student who has the ability to understand the atom can take the next crucial steps to comprehend many different aspects of chemistry. This DVD was created entirely by the student, for the student at Cushing Academy.